Hmm. Well, I moved my desk around and I don't think it's going to be a good idea. But uh, I guess for this time, while I change it again, I'm just going to go ahead and move on. The only thing is that I didn't want to put it here because it's going to get that area again, which is where the dresser is. And I kind of just wanted to go with all the back um, of my beauty stuff. Which I'm probably going to keep that there and then just put the desk here against this wall to get the natural lighting. But anyways, other than that, hello, bienvenidos, welcome back. And today we're going to be doing Boxy Charm. And this is how it it is and that's how it comes and it came up in that so I already did my foundation so I already had an idea of what was coming in here I had to open it and check what it was because I was excited to receive the variations of the palette which was um, Too Faced and Tarte but I got this one I guess um, it's not bad but it's not what I was kind of hoping for I just don't so this is the Violet Voss and it's the Essentials Pro Siri eyeshadow palette. I mean it's a pretty color but I wasn't excited about it. So these are it. Um there was this Dr. Brown Recovery Sleeping Mask, which deeply hydrates and moisturizes to reduce redness and signs of irritation. So this is a night mask. So this is the Hydrobiotics, like I mentioned. And this is the size of it, which is 1.7 ounce. And apply mask to clean dry skin before bedtime. Do not rinse. Use nightly. So I don't know if it's saying do not rinse once you wake up the next day or just don't, well, I mean, if it's a night mask to sleep with it, um, of course you don't rinse, but, yeah. So the other thing, I mean, chocolate. So we have the Hanks and Henry Slick with H, which is a blickety black. Everybody's mentioning and talking about trying to pronounce it. Which this is the eyeliner. And then we have Billion Dollar Brows. So I was excited to get this one. The Micro Blade Effect Brow Pen. So how this one looks can you see like the little bristles and then it goes to good so I hope you guys are gonna be able to see this um but anyways let's see so let's try this I'm sorry this lighting here So it's not bad actually, it kind of goes with my brills. So I'm just going to do the other one. Interesting. The only thing is that on this part here, like I over plugged, so I don't know if you guys can see, it's like missing some hairs, so it was kind of a hard time trying to get that part there, but um, that one's done. Next thing here is this Moda Pro 5 pack deluxe eye set. So I didn't get this month the Boxy Luxe financially. 
course but they were still able to send me this because I had already did the annual fee so um, the only thing is that they would just charge like the extra 20 something dollars for the bigger version which is um, valued at over 200 and um, they're coming up with new things as well got a hair right here anyways they're coming out with another one which is the um, they are they have a boxy charm 2.0 now and they're including boxy premium so it's the regular boxy charm boxy luxe and boxy premium and i think that one retails for 50 and it has also over 250 value or something like that and on that one you are able to pick a product or two out of what they're gonna send you're actually able to pick so i could probably for example i could have picked maybe one of the other palettes instead of um this one kind of thing if you understand that's what it's gonna be for the other one so on um, the first thing about these is that i really like the handles i don't know if you guys can see but i'll take a picture and then i'll post it but this is i just had to do that but i like it this is very nice and it has their Moto Pro um, logo on it. Um, let's see. On one side, I uh, then on the back it says uh, shade. So, um, smudger. This is a smudger. And then of course this is the line. And this is for the crease and to detail. So these are the five brushes and I really do like the feel of these. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to start off. I did put some of my, I just put the foundation on my lid. So let's just go ahead and go with the crease. And I'm going to go in with sand, which is going to be this one here. Um, I was thinking about using sand, terracotta, and maybe cinnamon, and maybe like gold, emerald. Well, I just want to use all the colors, but I don't know. Like the main idea was like um, this one, that one, and then this one because darker colors. And I figured in the bottom line, this one, and get some... And then maybe like this gold one just to kind of pop a color. I really... But I don't know. We'll see. Okay. We'll see what look I come up with here. So, first starting off with sand. It's more like an orangey color. So this is kind of pretty too for the fall. I'm going to turn you guys to kind of get away from that window lighting. But it's probably going to be a better idea to put you guys... I'll see. Oh, man. So it's not some of the shadow or foundation. Boop. Closet door over there. See, my room's awkward because it's got the closet door, the bathroom, and then on this wall here, it's the door to the bedroom. So, and that's where you guys were in between that wall at first. So it has a hair that it's sticking out. Can you guys see that right there? Focus. It's bugging me. Oh, tape us. So I guess oh, I was going to give you guys a tip for the hooded eye. But that's probably something else in another video. So going in with the detail, I'm getting the ter terracotta and then just applying this up here. And then going back with the first brush, just kind of blending it in. And now I'm going to get the smudger and going to get cinnamon and put this right here in the corner, like right on the crease.
and then oh I thought I was recording I don't know where I set off but um I use the mudger to um add the brown and I actually use the shade one but then I just ended up going with my finger and I'm just gonna do the other side and I'll be back okay so that's the look the final look and actually I am going to um, get the I want to use the pink but I think I'm gonna use the cream I'm just gonna use the cream and use that in the corner right there Yucca. and oh, I'm just gonna go with the fingers I see And just with the first brush, just kind of make sure that use my bigger fingers and make this. Okay, so the last product in here is this Hanks and Henry. Oh, I didn't even open this. I totally forgot to open it and swatch it for you guys. I had to walk out real quick. Okay, so let's, let's see. So that is pretty nice. It's I wanna I'm gonna get pro at this. Ooh. Check that out. Okay. Wow. Slides on nice. But I'm not at pro at this, so gonna take some time and then just fill it in just need some mascara and I'm ready to go so I like that some eyeliners um, when you're applying it, you could still see the eyeshadow through. This kind of does that, but not really. I always wanted to do something like that, but it never lasts last on me. So I'm just gonna do the other one, put the mascara on, some lips, and um what if I use this terracotta for a blush? Add some orangey to it. Hmm, why not? It's like I see. It's like fall, but what does it matter? Nothing important happens here. It's still like 900 degrees. No, I'm joking. It's still hot. So okay. So I'm gonna do my other line, my other eyeliner, mascara, lips, and I'll be back. So the lips are a little extra. I used the Wet n Wild, which I thought it was more like an orangey color, color, but it doesn't really look orange. On camera, it does look pink, but live, it's like a coral color, and it's more like a pink. So I use the mascara as always that I like so far. It's the big, um, big look from Pure, and I actually used the cream eyeshadow, this one here, for the highlight. And that is the final result. I hope you guys liked it and I'll see you guys on the next video. Please share and subscribe and have a good blessed day, night, wherever you're watching. Thank you. Bye. So I do want to say that I really liked everything and the palette works pretty. The pigmentation is nice and if you guys want to be part of this, I suggest you sign up now because the price will be going up. So enjoy it. Grab it. Get it. I honestly think it's well worth it, so just subscribe, try it out, if anything you could cancel, the beauty of it.